Hi and welcome. Welcome to your time of coffee or tea break. We're going to do a different reading today. So if you've got a situation that you want clarity in at the moment, if you just pause the video and then think of your situation because this is going to be answered by the angel. So we'll just say there's four cards here. Each one represents a season, spring, summer, autumn or winter. So this will signify how your situation is. So let's have this one. So that's winter. Winter is a situation. So if you've got a query or even if you haven't now is the time just to rest like the winter we need to really not go forth in action so it's all, all about contemplating what's going on getting more information finding how you really feel about it so winter is a great time to actually do that um, going inside reflecting so this is how we see the situation about moving forward. So for, for example, if, if it's like, oh, I want to be in a relationship, now's not the time. Or, oh, I want to change my job, now's not the time. So just reflect on what it is that you do want. Um, oh, I need to tell my partner this, now's not the time. Do you get the picture? <laughs> so let's have a look what we need to know regarding that situation. Okay. So, aha, uh -huh, this fits in very nice. The eagle. So you have the eagle. Now eagles fly very high, soar above the earth with their incredible sight. So what this means in your situation is resting, but searching, finding out where the prey is. <laughs> so when you're high, you're at an advantage point. So taking that step back, you're going to be able to see and gather more information. So. Say for instance, you'll think somebody's gossiping and talking or cheating or all sorts of things can happen. This is a time to really extract some more information. So that's a good card to have. Now these cards are the angels that can help you in your situation. Okay, so let's have a look. They can be very spiritual eagles, can't they? The uh, native Indians use them a lot in their power animals. So whatever an eagle actually means to you and how you can develop that in your own life, you can contemplate on that. So resting and... Okay, that's it. Let's have a look. Right, you've got Sacred Garden. So your situation will develop in a sacred garden. So to be able to fully comprehend your query, your question, is about taking the time to develop. When you have a garden, it takes time. So with your situation, you're gonna to have to plant the seeds, grow the seeds, nurture the seeds of your what you want. So it reminds me of the possibilities are endless situation. So what you sow now, you will benefit in the spring. So waiting here in the winter, you will get your spring and then your fulfillment of the summer. So this is important. And when it says a sacred garden, the angels are blessing you with what you want. So it's like in a whole abundance in your situation. So think of your direct question and relate it to that. 
we'll just give you a fairy message as well in this coffee break because I'm sure we'll have time to read that we'll see it about the fairies they can help just give a bit more clarity for you I like that it's searching okay so we've got fairy spotting so if you relate the fairy spotting to your situation, it's very much in teamed with the eagle and you've got to be looking and searching. So fairy spotting is good because it's all about the magic, believing. So believing in yourself. And this is where the sacred guardian angel is giving you the permission that if, if you see it, it's there. So that's on a positive way. That's why you have to wait for your um, situation to flourish. So I wish you well in that. Um, thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time. Enjoy your drink. Have a great day.